Welcome back to another video. If you're new here, I'm Joanna. Nice to see you. Now, for this week's video, first off, I know I look rough right now because for any time you have seen me, I had makeup on. And that was because I don't like how this looks about it for, you know, YouTube. <laughs> but. I decided not to do a journaling video today. I also had no idea what to do. So I thought I'd just do like a little get ready with me for like, since Valentine's Day is coming up, let's just pretend we're doing like a little Valentine's Day, even though, but we both know I'm not doing anything on Valentine's Day. I have to work, so nothing's happening. Anywho, so yeah, I'll just talk to you guys while I put makeup on and you'll see how bad I am at it because I don't know how to do it you'll see so I am breaking out so bad on my chin I don't know if you can see I hope you can see because it's terrible it's so this is huge there's one here and right here and then around my mouth I've been getting like dry patches and I don't understand why I don't get it I mean I have dry skin anyways but this is just ridiculous now, you know what I mean? Just really ridiculous and annoying. So, anywho, let's get, let's get into it. I am using, I don't know how to say this, but this is a watermelon burst hydrating primer. I always get, you know, the hydrating primers, whatever, cause you know, like I said, I have dry skin. So, we're gonna see if this helps this bad skin. And I got this for a gift for Christmas. And this will be a long video. I usually do my makeup pretty quickly because I don't want people to see that I'm doing it. <laughs> oh, it's fine. My sister's the only one home and she's not gonna walk in on me. I mean, she might. She does a lot. Do you guys put the primer on your eyes? That's always a question that I have wondered. We're just gonna slowly put things back because I take them out and use them. I also have all my brushes here. Then I'm going to use this little Milani color corrector thing that I've had for a while and it's about to be empty so I need to find a new one. Okay, to use the pinks. I only use the pink and the green which is for dark and red spots because I don't know what the yellow and the peach are for. Peach is diffuses discoloration. I don't know what that means. And yellow masks dullness. I don't know what that means either. So, what's the pink one? Brighten some dark areas. Put it under my eyes because. Ow! Okay. <laughs> oh my god, I have another pimple up here. Oh, kill me. I think I'm just breaking out because my period is supposed to come, but that's just annoying, you know? I also can barely see what I look like in this mirror because it's not bright enough in here. Also, another thing that's annoying, personally, I have pretty clear skin except when my period is coming you know like most girls but i still have a lot of scars on my face so i feel like it still looks like i break out a lot but i really don't and i don't know how to get rid of them i don't know and then a lot of stuff that i've seen is really expensive and i don't have the money i look ridiculous <laughs> and i also hope you guys can hear me because i don't really talk loud in general and my nose has been really red because my nose has been really runny lately. I'm not sick. I think it's just allergies. And it's always been red right here between my eyebrows ever since I was little. Also don't understand it, how that happens or whatever, but apparently it happens. I'm also putting this under my eyes. I know what you're thinking. Why don't you wait till you like blend out what's on your face? No. This is the only time I really use a sponge. I know I don't know what I'm doing. Today I didn't have to go into work. Praying. <laughs> it is Tuesday of the same week that this is up. Um, I didn't have to go in today. I work. If you guys listen to the podcast, nothing fancy. Link in the description. I look crazy. We're also filming an episode today. Anyways, what was I saying? Oh, if you listen to the podcast, you know that I work as a housekeeper, and it has slowed down so much since December, like, so much. And every day, if it's so slow, then they call somebody out. And I got called out today. 
and thank God because this weekend was a shit show. Okay, it was a shit show. Anywho, I'm using this BB Fresh Maybelline foundation. I don't know why I couldn't figure out the name, what it was called. It's okay. I'm using 120 medium sheer tint. Also, anytime I pick out, I'm also using a brush because I feel like when I use a sponge, it doesn't even stay on. I'm gonna get back to the foundation stuff. Whenever I get foundations and stuff, I literally just guess if it's my color. Nine times out of ten, I just get lucky. I just get lucky. Because I don't like testing it. That's weird to me. I also kind of get irritated with foundation because I want a full coverage one, right? I want a full coverage one so bad. And I watch a lot of like makeup videos and stuff and they're like, oh, this one is full coverage. Oh my God, look. And then I put it on, I buy it, I put it on. I'm like, this shit is not full coverage. I can see the scars pop through. Or am I just putting it on wrong? Like, that could be it too. I still look really pale. Oh my God, do you guys wanna know a story? So, <laughs> no story. It's not really a story. I got this mirror for Christmas from my mom, right? And when you press the button, it's supposed to light up. And it worked for like a week. And then one day, I pressed it. And it was like, doo -doo 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 -doo, like flashing. And I was like, that's weird. <laughs> and now it won't turn on. I don't know if the batteries died or whatever. Or I just need new batteries for it. But I don't have AAA battery oils. So how do I still look pale on camera? Oh, okay. It looks fine. I also am going to use this CoverGirl Outlast all day, whatever. I hope this doesn't, like, make me hella dark. That's another thing. When I put makeup on... <laughs> okay, without makeup, my cheeks are really pale. I don't know why, but my cheeks are really pale compared to the rest of my face. So, when I put makeup on, my face is all suddenly one color, so I think I look weird, you know? Also, fun fact about a lot of my makeup, I buy it from the clearance section at Target and hope that it's my shade. Nine times out of ten. Okay, not nine times. Let's say seven times out of ten it is. And then the other three times, probably slightly darker. And I'm like, I can still use it. Because I do have some that are too light, so I just mix them. Or I use it as like contour. Yeah, I don't know why that kind of didn't sound right to me. <laughs> now I'm going to use this elf powder on my because I feel like I look too shiny. And I don't like it. I hope I look better as a skull. And if you're watching this, you're like, girl, you're doing that wrong. Please comment. Because, again, I don't know what I'm doing. I really don't know what I'm doing. Half of the time, I'm guessing. I'm guessing, guys. Okay. Done with foundation. Now we're gonna use Maybelline Instant Age Rewind con Concealer. Ow, it feels like something's pulling my hair, and I don't know what. I think it's the necklace, but it's not hooked on anything. Ugh. With concealer and, like, contour. How do you guys put it on? Which one do you put on first? Because I never know. Never, never know. And this is the only one that's actually like been light enough and actually did what it was supposed to, which is actually pretty sharp. And then it looks like it doesn't do anything. Um, and then I'm gonna use this Iman Earth Medium. I think it's supposed to be like a powder foundation or whatever, um, but it's too dark, so I use it as a contour bronzer or whatever the fuck the dark part of the contour isn't that whatever i don't know also i don't know how to do this part i also feel when i do this i look like i'm trying too hard yeah and what i mean by i look like i'm trying too hard like i don't wear makeup so like i look like oh she's posing you know this is one of the things that i bought on clearance i want to know if this happens to anyone else when you put makeup on, does your eyelash just suddenly not know how to fucking work and you can't see anything? Cause mine fucking do. I just go back in with the same brush that I used for the foundation and then I just buff it out. I don't know if you can see a difference, but I did it. Also, nose, nose, <laughs> nose contour. Also. Like I look alive now. 
Also, like I said, I don't wear makeup, but I have a shit ton of it because I'm always like, no, today's the day. I'm gonna start wearing makeup. But then <laughs> I put it on and I'm like, this is not who I am. We don't do this. Mm -mm. Anywho, we're gonna use this little makeup palette that I got for my birthday last year. It's Exotic Pop. I'm using it because it has a bunch of colors, so yeah. Okay, now we're gonna <laughs> do the eye look. I don't know how to do this. I tend to do the same thing every time I do something with the eyes, which it doesn't look bad. I'm just, you know, I wanna try and switch it up. I probably won't, but we're just, we're just, we're gonna see. Since it's Valentine's Day, I'm gonna make it like a pink thing, obviously, you know? Why does it look like there's something maybe? There's not, it's probably just the shine. Also, I don't use highlighter. Do you? I don't, I don't own highlighter. I'm gonna use this color cherry that I can see I've used a lot. So, and I don't know about you guys, but I'm not one of those people who does one eye and then the other. Like, I do them both at the same time. Also, I'm holding this up because I can't fucking see. But the thing that I tend to do when I'm doing the eye stuff, I put, you know, the lighter one in the corner and just a darker version on the outside. And literally that's it. <laughs> Which, again, it doesn't look bad. It looks like I tried, but I didn't. That's the tea. Also, if you wear makeup, how long does it take you to do it? Because so far this is almost gonna be 30 minutes and I'm pretty sure it'll be 30 minutes. And that is the time I take, I strive. I will never take longer than that. <laughs> Mainly because I know it's not gonna make a difference if I take any longer, you know? Oh, I'm gonna talk about the brushes that I use, okay? I don't know if y'all have been to Target or whatever, but I always get those like provision eyeshadow palettes. I literally, I think I have all of them. Why when I don't wear them? How if I know? I think I just want all of them. I think I just have that tendency to just want everything, <laughs> even if I'm not gonna use it. Oh my god. Anywho, and they each come with one brush, and that's all the brushes that I have. And then a couple like elf stuff and then these ones that I got this year for Christmas <laughs> past year for Christmas whatever you know what I mean Ooh. also another thing that I do a lot because I know it looks good on my eyes I always do like a sunset thing <laughs> I know it looks good it's like one of the only things that looks good consistently no matter what also keep that foundation brush around you can clean up anything <laughs> Now we're gonna do a slightly darker color on the outside, and then I'm gonna try something different. We're gonna go with this plum color. I hope it's like in the pink reddish family, whatever. A little purpley, but it's okay. Also, you know, it'd be so disappointing if you couldn't even see the entire thing that I was doing this whole time. Then it would defeat the purpose of this entire video. Also, I'm one of those people who usually just puts tape down to make it look like it's winged or whatever, because I can't do eyeliner and it kind of depresses me, like I've tried, I have tried everything and it doesn't work, it doesn't work at all. And so the closest thing I can get to that is putting tape down and just like winging up the eyeshadow. It actually doesn't look too bad actually. How's it look to you guys? I can't see how I look on the thing, so I hope I look fine. Okay, there we go. Now it's time for the thing that I'm going to try. I'm gonna just put like a line of black and try and buff it up. Cause I've always, uh, ever since I could start wearing makeup, I have just wanted to try and do a smoky eye. But every time I do it, I look like a fucking idiot. So we're gonna see if I can kind of do it with this. I really hope I don't mess it up because then this video will be over. It will be over. I also realized that I didn't put blush on. I also have one blush that I have had forever since I was in high school and I just turned 23. Oh, I'm so old. Oh, that just made me a little depressed. I also have no other blush. Only one blush I own. <laughs> Again, just keep the foundation brush you have. Now here we go. We're gonna, we're gonna try this new thing. It's a good line. Oh, I don't think you get how proud I am about just lying right here. 
I don't like it right now. I think I was being overly ambitious. I, I tried. I really did. Wow, does she know what she's doing? Nope. I really tried, y'all. I really flew and tried. I messed it up. Okay, you know what? <laughs> you know what? We really tried. And sometimes, you know what guys, we try and we don't always succeed. And this happens to me constantly. Now I just put the same color that we used in the first place or because it disappeared. We just kinda cute now. I think I saved it. And you know what, since it's Valentine's Day and I usually don't do this, let's make it a little sparkly. We're gonna use this one, it says no limit. You can't even fucking see it. You can't fucking see it at all. I don't know if it's because it's not fucking coming off of here. Or what the fudge ever. Whatever. The I just makes the two of them. Also, don't you hate it when your eyes are two different shapes? Because this one oh wait. I have a lazy eye and I can't remember which one it is. And I'm trying to see and I can't tell. And it's one or the other. Now we're just gonna do the lips and put mascara on and then we're done. I also don't know what this is, I got it for Christmas. Also, I don't know how to match lip stuff with eye stuff or any of that. I don't know shit. So if you want to teach me, I just put in the comments, hey dumbass. We're supposed to do this. Well, let's not use dumb. <laughs> Cause that'd be a little hurtful. Also, is like lip liner essential? Because I've never bought it. I've always wondered that. Do you need a lip liner in your life? Please comment and let me know. If you heard my dogs, I'm sorry. They're annoying. I have three of them. Also, I get hella chapped lips, so I always I hate a Mac, a Mac, matte look. Okay, and then I'm gonna just use this like. Apparently, this is mascara primer. I guess. Also, I had an idea for videos, but I watch a lot of, especially now because of quarantine, as you all know, watch a lot of movies and TV shows, and. I always have a lot to say. Granted, hear me out on this one part though. I literally just found my eyelash curler and now it's gone. I'm kind of depressed now because I found it. And then I'm gonna use this oh, fucking mascara. I don't fuck I'm not. Anywho, these were on clearance when I bought them. So I bought like four and it was like a while ago. And I think it's funny because Suddenly on TikTok, everyone likes this mascara. And I'm like, why weren't y'all buying it then? Anywho, the idea that I have is just <laughs> me talking shit about movies and TV shows. And I thought it'd be a good idea. Um, I have a couple ones already like in my head and like I'm planning it out. Um, but if you guys want to see that, let me know. And what you want me to possibly watch. And I'll think about it. <clears throat> I'm gonna be honest, I don't really watch a lot of things that are suggested to me. Oh, I'm an asshole. I know. Yeah. You were doing so good. It didn't get on my eyes. Nothing. And then it goes and does that. I'm really mad that I don't know where my eyelash color is. Okay, whatever. Done with that. We're just gonna try and take them. Anywho. This is the final look. I know it doesn't look great. I tried my best, but yeah. If you have any tips for me in regards to doing makeup, please comment them because I don't know what I'm doing. I also don't do my eyebrows because they are um, thickums already. And I feel like if I do them, then I look like hella bushy eyebrows. And I'm not down for that look, you know? That's just me. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe, please. And send this to your friends so I can get more people to watch me, please. Like, I just hate my job, so I don't want to do it anymore. So please do that. If you want to see me outside of YouTube, go follow my social medias. Joanna and Jake Calderon, also in the description. And go listen to the podcast that I do with my best friend, Jaden. Nothing fancy, also links in the description for the YouTube channel and the Spotify link. It's also available on Google Podcasts, Apple Podcasts, 
Breaker, Overcast, Radio Public, and Pocket Cast. Go check it out. I also don't know most of them, but they're available. On Anywho, thanks for watching. That's the video. Bye. <laughs>